So hey y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Shasha Shasha. Shy. Um morning y'all. It is currently Saturday. Say it's 21st or 22nd. I don't even really know. I can't tell y'all right now. But what I do know is that my mouth is killing me. Like legit killing me. I've taken adults out now. I've taken kids out now. I've gargle the salt water i've even done something that i should have done and i used some um knockoff or gel like i'm not gonna lie to y'all i obviously didn't use a lot but i wasn't supposed to use any at all but i did because something had to at least ease the paint up and nothing has been working i've been going through this since the pain been excruciating for the past two days prior to this uh, and I've been waking up constantly back and forth, back and forth, like every other hour trying to get some type of relief to like relax my gums or something. I've been massaging them and everything and, and nothing has really been working. If I'm not woke, I'm asleep. Like I'm trying to sleep the pain away and it just got to the point now where it's just too much to bear. Like I've been going through this for months and because I have state insurance, I have not been able to get in anywhere with anybody. I'm tired of suffering. I'm finna go to the emergency room. Cause I can't take it no more. Then my baby girl is going crazy. I don't know what's wrong with her. I don't know if she can feel my pain or what. But she just been um literally going crazy, like nonstop moving. I don't know if it's for the medicine of me taking or what. But she's been moving before I even took that medicine, but it's like she's moving. A whole lot more or something but now she's not moving at all it's like i don't know how to explain it like i don't know but the hospital i know they can monitor that and they can give me something for my pain in my mouth or something because i need i need to be able to monitor my baby make sure my baby's okay as well i've only seen my baby once in the ultrasound that's it i don't know anything about her like what's going on with her or anything i'm just waiting for Uh, somebody to get them. If somebody could get them, I, I can do everything else on my own. I don't need nobody to go nowhere with me, nothing. I can do everything else on my own once. I have someone to come get them. I'll contact my mom, and I'll contact his mom. So, whoever gets here first, gets here first. But, baby, they can keep these teeth at the hospital with them when I leave. They can keep them. I can't even do it no more. All right, y'all, so I'm here now. I ended up going to the dentist first, but they said they weren't doing walk-ins, even on the phone. They told me they were doing walk-ins. Well, not even them. The people that connect you to them, pretty much. She said that they didn't say they weren't doing walk-ins, so that they were doing walk-ins. And I got there, they weren't doing walk-ins. And then not to mention that, they don't even have an oral surgeon there. It's like none of these dentists have oral surgeons. I guess the oral surgeon has to be planned in advance and whatnot. Ooh, it's warm. It feels good, too. But that was such a waste of time because she really took me all the way to the other side of town. And that's that's how they were moving. But, yeah. Sorry I charge this in a way because I'm charging my phone. Well, I got a ball spot. I don't. But she just gave me a blanket because she said it's going to be chilly. It's really not chilly up in here because I'm hot. But this is warm and it feels good. It feels better. I'm not like hot, but I'm not cold either. But I'm just waiting. Um, they all were thinking I was coming up in there to uh, have a baby. I wish. <laughs> I wish, girl. I really, really wish. But I'm just trying to make sure that nothing is affecting my baby. While I'm sitting here taking all this medicine and stuff, trying to relieve my pain. I need to be able to know, know her status and stuff too. So that's really why I was like, yeah, I'm going to just come to the ER. And I was that was my original plan anyway. But she asked me if I wanted to go to the dentist. And I'm like, yeah, I guess I'll go. Because she said she would take me. All right, so hey, y'all. Welcome to my channel. My name is Shasha. Shasha, Shasha. Happy Sunday. In a better mood, better spirits than yesterday. Because my mom was hurting so bad yesterday. I don't even know what part of that vlog I'm going to keep. But, um... Yeah, long story short, I ended up myself up in the hospital, and now I'm here. 
Mommy. With Mommy. the boys. What? Hi. Say hey. Alright, before we do anything, we're gonna go. Alright, so I'm gonna. So, first, I'm gonna go grab something to eat for us really quickly because I'm hungry, I'm starving. And then I have to go to the grocery store and get some fruit. Uh, yeah, some fruit. And like a couple household things, not too many things. Not too many things, though, but. That. I feel like it was something else I needed to do. I wanted to take them to the park, but we're gonna see how they behave here. What else, y'all? I'm trying to think. I can't think, but I got a tube this on. Oh, I was trying to walk baby girl down. We're gonna walk her a little behind down. She getting a little too comfortable. I know she getting a little too comfortable because she not. Mm -hmm. She ain't doing enough for me. And I've been taking that medicine and stuff like that. I don't know if that's making her that way or what, but so we finna go ahead. And by medicine, I mean just Tylenol, other than that one dose of Oxy they gave me yesterday. It was only five milliliters, but we finna go ahead, get something to eat, and then we're gonna, um, we're gonna go ahead and run my errands that I gotta run. Party, y'all. So we're coming at Mickey D's. I just paid for our food. Chase, where you at? No key left out. Chase. Yeah. They mouth is blue for them ring pops. I should never get them. Get it still, but we just hungry. You said hey the first time. I thought you wanted it from the first time. Mommy, I didn't know the video. Bro, kids are so. Gotta show you everything. It's. <laughs> but. Uh, now he's saying he didn't show you all his stuff. They can see that your tongue is blue. It's all over your mouth. I got some baby wipes for him and wipe mouth before you go in the store, though. But I'm finna let them eat first. We all finna eat something real quick. Make our store run. I'm gonna go back home. By the time we get back home, Chakari! By the time we get back home, it's gonna be time to eat. It's gonna be time to make dinner, so chicken is already thawing out. Mission, get this baby out of me. Starts now. Already, I'll head to Burlington now. Where else they have anything? Well, they have this little outfit, but I don't like them because when I wash the other one, I only have the one wear. He washed the whole face of the shirt off. And that's how them shirts are made up in here. So I won't get in that outfit for them. All right, y'all, we just look at the Ross and Burla 10. I can't vlog with them with me, I ain't gonna lie. Like, when they in the store with me, I can't vlog. But um, I found a good deal on Shikari, some underwear and some um, T-shirts from back to school. So I did grab those because they were a good price. I just have to find the twins some. I know their price is probably not gonna be as good as his, but I could not, I was not finna let that deal go. $6.99 for a pack of t-shirts, five pack at that, and then $6.99 for the underwear too, and that's a pack of eight. Be for real. Your girl wanna snatch that on up. I'm like, I'm not gonna get this deal nowhere else. That's why I'm happy I got the able bags and stuff out of the way because all this stuff is getting cleared out real fast. Um, I have not been to school supplies or anything like that yet. And I really just need to go to go get um, some fruit and stuff. And I haven't did that because I wanted to be outside for a little bit and not go back in right away. So, yeah. Here's that. Probably gonna start my mom's house. Cause they, they lost their privilege to go to the park. So yeah, we're not going to the park, baby. They was up in them stores showing out. They was misbehaving. They been misbehaving even before then though, so yeah. 
They're not going to the park. They lost their, uh, come on, go. They lost their chance at going to the park. I'm gonna do my stops that I need to do first, my little rounds. They go my rounds. I was gonna dodge you, but I don't remember what I was gonna dodge you for. I know that I needed to go, but girl, you gotta spend that money at Burlington. Mm-mm-mm. But it wasn't nothing, it obviously wasn't nothing super important because I wouldn't have forgot it. I would have forgot what it is. But I'll show y'all what I got once I get to my mama house. Alrighty, y'all, we back home. If y'all can't tell by that birthday banner already, I'm gonna take that down. I'm gonna take that down. I promise, I'm gonna take that down. Somebody, if I remember, if I remember now. No promises, but. We're back. We went to my mama's house. We've been at my mama's house the entire time, y'all. We ain't even got to the park. We didn't go. Um, nowhere else. We've only been at my mama's house. We've been at my mama's house for like three or four hours. I had eight. Got me a little meal in or whatever. Because let me tell you about McDonald's, y'all. I went to McDonald's and they burnt our buns. They burnt our buns. I'm going to uh, insert a picture. Yeah, these kids done drove me crazy all day. Not gonna lie to y'all. Real parenting, real parents. If you a real parent, then you not. But they done drove me crazy all day. Through crying, fighting, running, yelling, screaming, something like. It's just been too much. But y'all know I went to Burlington earlier. I said I was gonna show y'all what I got. So I'm gonna show y'all what I got so I can end up the vlog. It's like after 8 o'clock. I don't like filming late no more. So let me hurry up and go ahead and show y'all what I got. So the first thing I got was the boys some um, three in one shampoo conditioner body wash. This is with 100% natural lavender, and it says zero percent sulfates, parabens, silic silicones, and dyes. So you know the good stuff. Try just to make you buy. It. But I like the way it smells. It's not over overbearing lavender smell. Cause I hate. I'm not a big fan of lavender. I'm not gonna say I hate it, but I'm not a big fan of lavender. But this is not strong like how the dr teal's like um sleepy spray is it's not as loud it's like a baby soft smell and i like that and this is by the brand swap kids and then i have another one just i have another one like that but it's a different scent this is coconut oil this is what this one looks like it's blue and this one's on sale for the same price and it's spilled it's spilled out and i'm happy that's why i told her to put it in a different bag it smells good though but it's just the same situation, just different scent. And then I told y'all, I think I told y'all already, I had caught a deal on Shikari's underwears and t shirts for school. For going back to school or whatever. He's not gonna wear these now, like I said, they're for school. I have to go through their underwear and stuff like that and see which ones I'm throwing away because it's a lot of two T three C's that can be just thrown away. And a lot of stained underwears. Hold the little underwears that have little tiny holes that I might have missed. I usually throw them away when I first see it, if it has a hole or something like that. Um, then we can get rid of some of the bleached underwear. Like some stuff I use for accidents. Sometimes at night or whatever. But they have so many underwear, I can really get rid of them. But anyway, this is the underwear I got for Shikari. It's an 8-pack. These are 45T. It's for um, weight between 34 and 38 pounds. Damn, can he fit these? He like 40 pounds, honestly. Mm. Hopefully he can fit these, because these are briefs. And they're tag free. Like I said, these are eight, this is the eight pack for only $6.99, y'all. $7 for an eight pack of um underwear. And if y'all go to like Walmart, Target, or any other little store that sells, for the little money where y'all know these are going to be about 12 13 14 15 bucks for little kids underwear but i'm happy i caught yay me shopping smart and then i also found him some t-shirts a five pack they were not open not tampered with or anything like that no ribs no tears on nothing they do sound here slightly imperfect i don't know what that means so I guess this is like stuff that was that didn't work out for them. Uh, like the company, I guess. But on here it does not say that. On the underwear it don't say that. 
Yeah, I don't know we don't have that same sticker. I didn't see that until now, but it looked white to me and everything. I'm gonna check it out though and see what's going on with it once I do it. But that could mean like they printed the um, labeling crooked or anything. So we're gonna see. But it's five t shirts up in here, and this is only $5.99. So that was a good price. And I think I'm I'm gonna have to get him more anyway. So I'll just grab him another pack when I go get the boys theirs. And probably grab him another pack of underwear. And then I'm gonna um I have to just get the twins two packs for each because there's gonna be more anyway. And they were a size six to eight now. So we're moving on up in the world. And last but not least, I got me a pack of socks. This was like a last minute decision because I seen that they were on sale. They were only on sale for $3.69. $3.69, yes. And they were, it's 12 pairs. I, I was kind of, you know, uh, I was kind of skeptical about getting them because I don't like buying white socks because when you wear white socks one time, I don't even walk in my socks, but my socks never return back to how I wore them. Like, I will wear the socks, leave them looking like this, when I take them off, and they'll still come back from the washer and dryer darker than what they were. Like, bruh, I didn't even walk in the socks. But that's sad. We're gonna let them try their new um body wash, shampoo, and conditioner out tonight. See what it's giving. And yes, they have eczema, so I'm trying to see how this will work. But they use something with lavender in there now. So I don't think that should be an issue. And they was used, they previous one had coconut in there. I feel like as long as they're moisturizing after they get out, that it's really just chances even right now. Chikaris hasn't acted up acted up in a while, like months. But hands is even on the other hand. I just had to, I've been using his cream. If y'all watch my watch me get them ready, y'all see me using that little tube that was like the tricepalone or whatever. Yeah. So yeah, I forgot to go to the store and get some bread and some um, soda drink. That's what I went outside for. Let me go, hold on. Mm -hmm.